Often considered the Silicon Valley of the South, Huntsville is among the fastest growing tech cities in America. CBS reports that Huntsville's growth among technology companies outpaces much of the rest of the country. News 19's Joker Dot brings us behind the scenes of a collaborative effort translating growth into jobs and opportunities across the Tennessee Valley. To build that connectivity and to build the pathways so that we can provide the right kind of resources to our entrepreneurs that we are we are looking to help succeed. So um, at any given point, you know, we want to collaborate. We want to be able to uh, fill in the gaps. Rigva Joshi is the director of the Invention to Innovation Center, or I2C, at the University of Alabama in Huntsville. The building facilitates partnerships, collaboration, ideas, and think tanks for entrepreneurs across the Tennessee Valley. Entrepreneurship is, you know, in this current state, one of the most important things that we can experience or that's happening throughout the country. Uh, you know, in spite of the coronavirus pandemic, we are seeing um, entrepreneurs, you know, really trying their level best to stay afloat. While some COVID-stricken economies are trying to stay afloat in much of the country, Huntsville's economy is on fire in a good way. Many people that I spoke with say there are a shortage of workers across sectors of the Huntsville economy across the city. Facilities like this help build connections to help fill some of those gaps. My experience has been every time that we're hiring a, a new employee, um, they're, they're already employed with somebody else. So it's a very competitive market. JS Solutions is among technology companies in the area broadening their horizons at I2C. Intuitive Research and Technology Corporation has a corporate innovation center at I2C. You're going to see a surge of entrepreneurism, a surge of companies like Intuitive moving into commercial markets with spin-ups and startups that they're fostering. I think you see I think you're going to see more and more of that. In Huntsville, Joe Kadat, News 19.